they won't keep you here for the full three months. Only two months. Then down to JT on a ferry boat. You will say goodbye to this place. Then straight to Victor Fenster prison on the mainland. Life will change for you there. It will be much easier. Because you won't take Hodosha with you. He will stay here with me on the mainland. They will put you to work in a wine yard at Victor Fenster prison. There will be no queries there. Eating grapes, oranges, they will change your diet. Diet C. And exercise so that you look good when they let you out finally. At night, we'll play games. Ludo, droughts, snakes, and leathers. And then one day, they'll call you into the office with a van waiting outside to take you back. The same 500 miles, but this time, they will let you sit. You won't have to stand the whole way like you did coming here. There will be no handcuffs. They might even stop on the way so that you can have a pee. Yes, I'm sure they will. And you might even sleep over someone. Then finally, Port Elizabeth. Royan Prison again. John, that's near home, my brother. New Printing is next door. Through your cell window, you will see people moving up and down the street. Here, buses rolling. And then that day you won't sleep again because you will be counting. Not days like you are doing now, but hours. And then the next morning, that beautiful morning, they will take you out of your cell into a discharge office and give you a khaki shirt with a long khaki trousers and brown shoes and your belongings. I almost forgot your belongings. But it doesn't end there. Your people will take you home, 38 Grattan Street, John. Everybody will be waiting for you there. Your aunts, uncle, neighbors, and friends. They will put you in a chair like a king and give you anything you want. Cakes, sweets, cold drink, and you will start to talk. You will tell them about this place. You will tell them about Hodosha. You will tell them about the query. And about your good friend Winston. Who you left behind. But you still won't be happy, hey? Because you will need a fuck. A real wild one. That is why at 10 o'clock that night you will walk out through the back door and make your way to Sky's place. Imagine, man. All the boys will be waiting for you there. Mangi, Georgie, Wusmus, they will fill you up with booze. They will look after you. They know what it's like inside. They will fix you with a woman. Set you up with her in a comfortable joint and leave you alone. You will watch her. You will watch her take her thoughts off. You will take your pants off. Get near her. Get her. Feel her. Feel it. Yes. You will feel it.